Strategy of Mutual Harmonization for Increased Online Sales While you are not standing face-to-face -face with your customers online, you can use the same strategy by using many of the same phrases that will elicit agreement from your visitor. It will have to be something that most people would have a difficult time replying no to, otherwise, the first no in their minds is what breaks the spell. You want very innocuous phrases that are tied to statements that are generally positive and produce agreement on the part of the person reading them. Besides these subtle verbal clues, you can actually make a person agree with you through mirroring their behavior. Although this works best in face-to-face -face encounters, the strategy can be implemented online in group forums and social networking sites. So, we'll discuss it next, the psychology infants learn how to mimic their parents and that's how they learn many of their own behaviors. In general, when we don't know how to act in a particular situation, we have been taught to look to others to gain wisdom from the experience of others. Those people we look up to, we also emulate, and this is also a form of mirroring. So, there are basically two foundational behaviors associated with mirroring, learning and socializing. If you are sitting in front of a new product now, part of what you need to do to make a decision is to learn about it. If you've already got an agreeable authority on the product in front of you, the salesperson, then the likelihood that you will use their knowledge to help make a decision is very likely. But, if you really want to trust this person, they have to be likable. So, the fact that they start to mirror you or lead you into an agreeable frame of mind will help that you make up your mind on whether to close the sale or not.